This is week of AGCC. Um, we had a pretty like, tough training over the weekend. And then yesterday we just worked on techniques, so today we're just kind of starting it off again. At least the mentality behind it is just like, you shouldn't do anything different that you would do for any other competition. So we'll go a little softer today, go hard tomorrow, and then fly out Wednesday, hit one more training on Thursday, like pretty soft, just to try to peak physically right before the tournament. And then on Friday, just chill, stretch, and get ready to go. Oh shit, that was on camera? Wow, I didn't know. You my mouth, Paul almost forgot his shit too, but we're just going over some of the moves. He's like hitting heel hooks from all sorts of different places. I mean, we probably would have gone hard if we would have had our full team, but we got other guys that got competitions and shit. And then, like, I guess we have been going hard the last few days, so I guess some people are taking some days off. But we own the saw, so we don't we don't really need, need they saw. Especially <laughs> that guy right there. If you ask him, he's taller than me, but smaller than me. And both of those are lies. This man is about 5'11 on a good day. At about 2.30, but I've never seen him on a scale in my life. <laughs> well, let me get back on that camera real quick. <laughs> I got a lot to say out of nowhere, man. A lot to say. Mm. I just crafted some opinions on the floor. Huh? So has this mostly been the squad or? Yeah, I mean... The two brothers, obviously, they've been training together their whole life, and for about two years I've been training with them, and honestly, never really focused on Nogi as much until I started with them, and yeah, man, this has been it. This is the squad. We're five sleeps out for, from Paul for ADCC, so it's just an easy day today. We've been going hard for like seven days, so it's easy today. We're supposed to be. Until Sergio gets mad, and then it's no longer easy. What's important is Ernesto doesn't do geek, all right? I've said this a lot. This has been hurt. Yo, it's easy until you almost pass Ernesto or almost score any points on this man, then he starts throwing head kicks. First of all, call the shoulder kicks. I mean, you can release it. You, you, you gotta move your knee though. Move your knee. 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 Move I made this move up right here. They've never done this before. That's right. I'm like, thanks to no one's help, I made this up. 15, 17, 19, and now 22. This is my fourth one. My first one, Brambo. So it comes actually. I'm gonna get this video back on the S. He beat me. Then I'm gonna get Jackson Souza. Referee decision. 
then Trator. Last five penalties. Oh, now this one. So we'll see, man. Yo, if you're good luck, I'm gonna win this shit. <laughs> but if I lose, it was because <laughs> of you, <laughs> man. Specifically. Four. Four? Yeah. Two, no. I won 15, 17. Got invited 19. So anyway, then I told him. <laughs> and then I was like, yo, throw the heel hook from the bottom. <laughs> and then the rest and was history. Did it. Break it. <laughs> and the rest was history. After that, I was like, yo, throw it again, why not? Do that five times. Look at that. It just worked. But what happened in the sixth match? That's the one I was like, yo, do something different. <laughs> Make yourself seem human, you know, and then <laughs> go underestimate you a little bit. Give me something to think about. And then go back to you. <laughs> so it's like, I call that the old switch of moves. <laughs> I have people that I know are some of the best in the world training with me. So they've been pushing me a lot. Um, I feel like my technique is much better. I'm also like really excited to see what people's heel hook defense is like now because now people know that that's what I'm going for. So yeah, I mean, uh, Jacob, it's been pretty good, and I'm kind of prepared for a lot of counter attacks. So. It's mostly been here and like either bouncing from here and ATT. Yeah, yeah. I mean, the majority of ATT, but my boy Ernesto trains here, so we'll come here. I uh, train with him and some of the squad. And then we have some other guys from different gyms coming. Uh, and then we hit the sauna. <laughs> Y'all may not see us in the sauna, man, because we don't want to damage the camera, man, but trust me. Saunas where it really goes down. That's where the, that's where the brainstorming goes down. Is that the uh, notorious sauna? My yeah, brother trained there. Who? My brother's in the sauna with me, by the way, one of my main training partners. There. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We have to be very clear about this. Just sauna etiquette, especially for television standards. I don't know how people look. You can't just be turning the camera around and be like, here's my brother. Yep, that's the notorious one. Yo, that's where, hey, Sergio's, Sergio's dick and nuts became famous thanks to me, man. You're welcome. My dick and nuts been famous, all right? You just gotta know who to ask. Yo, cut that out, man, cut that out. <laughs>